Do re mi fa so. La ti do. La ti do. Hello, Kim. Hello. How are you doing today? Just dandy. How are you? Just great. I feel like we missed hello for like multiple weeks, and now we can say hello. Hello. Hello, good day to you. Good day. Chip, chip, cheerio. <laughs> what did we get to play with today? We got to play with the Aurora Ypsilon. Yes. Bum, bum, bum. And we shared actually my hubby's pen. And I blame you for him getting this pen. What, me? What yes, did I do? Yes, because uh, last year, right before Christmas, oh, this was our WTF, <laughs> and it was hanging on a golden tree, on like a little golden ornaments. Tree. <gasps> and he saw it, and he was like, nope. He sent me a text saying, I, I like that pen. And I said, oh, we're having a debate in the office. Jason says he likes the green, mm -hmm. Steph likes mm -hmm. the orange, I like the blue. What do you think? You're the deciding vote. And he said, I think I like the orange. So then I went downstairs, Sneaky. I know. Look at you, just sliding right in I there. I know, it is a snap cap. But I call it a dual snap cap because it doesn't okay. just snap here. You put it, it here. It snaps on the back too. It snaps on the back too. It, and the cap is secure on there. Yep, yep. You don't have to worry about it flinging across the room. It, you know, it doesn't just slide on. You don't have to twist it on like yeah. some of the previous pens we've been doing. It, it just snaps right in there. It's such a clean snap. The regular Ypsilons that you can order on Anderson pens, they're steel nibs and mm -hmm. they come in extra fine, fine, medium, broad, and italic. Which is cool. The one um, that we used was a medium. Oh. But then you can also order, I think it's called the Quadro and the Deluxe. And mm -hmm. those come with 14 karat gold. Oh, you have one I there. I have one right here. <gasps> the steel one is a little less decorated, whereas yes. the gold one has a, a bit more ornamentation and decoration yes. to it. They're both lovely, but uh, oh, yeah. if you want that extra pizzazz and a gold nib, yeah. it's an option. It is cool that you have both options. Because I know some mm -hmm. people have to have their gold nibs, and then other people are like, I love steel. As long as it writes good, right? Yeah, exactly. Yep, Which these did. Um, it's a cartridge converter. Indeed. But so look at how big this cartridge is. It is. is. It's huge. So they come with a cartridge but they also come with a converter. I, I've been using my Sailor a lot lately, so I've been kind of falling back into, I wouldn't say bad habits, but just broader broader nibs. Um, and I just, I don't know, I've just been using some nice shading inks and it's just that juicy, shading, beautiful, oh, it's just wonderful. Um, but that was a medium and in black, so that was kind of away from what I've been doing. Right. But no, I really enjoyed it. I can't remember which paper I used. Not that, I, I guess it does matter. Mr. Paper would yell at me. Oh I almost gosh. said that doesn't matter. <laughs> of course it matters, it definitely matters. It wasn't like super, super uh, smooth like some mm -hmm. other mediums. It had a little bit of feedback. I don't know how you felt about it. Not in a bad way, but you could tell it's like you were you were writing versus buttery smooth. It wasn't buttery just like, smooth. yeah, gliding across the page. Depending on your preferences, that could be good or it could be bad. Yeah. I, I didn't mind it. I like buttery smooth more. Sometimes it's nice to have that little bit of feedback. Yeah. Uh, I've been kind of, I don't know, having arguments for both sides in that way. An internal struggle. It, yeah. It's, just, it's like I have like the, the, the devil angel and the, the angel. Devil. Just, Jason, use the fine pen. Jason, use the broad pen. I don't know. Maybe I should turn yeah, that which around. Yeah, would be the devil. Right, because I made the devil sound like the broad pen. That, Maybe that they're both work angels. For me. Maybe they, yeah, exactly. Mm. These come in a ton of different colors. We just grabbed a couple up here, but not only do they come in a couple different colors, there's the matte or satin finish, yep. which is the one that we have here. And I really like mm -hmm. the feel of this. I do too. And this is the regular, I don't know what it's called. Is it just a regular resin? Uh, resin? Resin. Uh, yeah, it's just like polished. Um, yeah. It's just the shinier look. A little look. bit shinier. I preferred the uh, the matte as well. It just, uh, I don't know, it just had a nice feel in the yeah. hand. Uh, like something it. we didn't mention with the deluxe actually versus this one. So all the, uh, I guess the non-deluxe versions have like the black section there. Mm -hmm. Whereas the deluxe, depending on what color you have, there's like a little bit of a, a color in the, oh, the clip yeah. there. And then the section also matches. <gasps> so uh, And I also noticed that uh, it comes in, they come in a variety of trim yes. colors. There's gold and then rose gold, which is what this one is. <gasps> Blue and rose gold. This is I my favorite that one. one. Mine too. And silver or uh, rhodium. Basically a flavor for every, every taste or every day of the week even. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, how are we gonna finish? But Kim, Kim, Kim! Nib noobs.